Well, good morning, guys. Trying to get some work done while also working. Work working. And I want to get these lights installed, the minimum lights. Uh, we, uh, let me put these over here. Ah. I went ahead and uh, about two to three coats on this, so it's good and protected, which is what matters, and it's not going to look weird when I reinstall these lights. Um, uh, yeah, not all the way done by any means, obviously, got some spots, but uh, the, the important stuff is ready to go back in. Not exactly sure what I want to do up there, because I like the idea of using stop lamps, you know, regular stop lamps, uh, for the reds and then leaving the ambers for the turn signals. I like that idea uh, But I'm not sure yet I'm not sure uh, It would make sense, you know, of course uh, So we'll we'll see could use red at the front again, but you know, that's not ideal I would use white, but I'd have to run a, a separate switch for that um, again, not you know, not terribly difficult, but uh, I'm trying to use all existing Kind of existing gear. Let's see, how did I get this out of here? Okay, almost there. Okay. That's still hooked up. All right, that was probably a better way to do that. <laughs> Let's see, what does that look like? Yes. Got these guys in. Um, yeah, pulling them out, separating them from the rubber frame, um, uh, doesn't really make it that much easier. I mean, you can get the rubber in easier, but then you have to struggle with the light and the plastic. But those are in, those aren't going anywhere, so good. Now, the fun part is trying to figure out how to get these resecured. Uh, this guy came with screws, and so getting them plugged back in is very easy and then we just got a actually have a sticker uh let's see they did turn signals on the outside so yep 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 so these are a simple let's see yep, three okay go ahead and plug this light in oh oh yeah i forgot there are uh Incandescence in here, but hey, looks pretty good. All right, yeah, you know, I might. I don't know if I want to go with an amber on the uh, the inside and a red on the outside. Um, hmm, it's kind of interesting. Yeah, those are bright. Oh, ooh, those are bright. Okay, we're legal, <laughs> which is great. Um, this guy's working okay, but uh, the little guy here is not. That's kind of weird. And uh, unless for I plug it into the wrong, I don't think that's uh, even possible. Let's see though. Should be the same. Does it look like there's a difference? Oh, oh yeah. Okay, weird. Functionally, they should be similar, but uh, I guess that's not. Man, those, uh, when you get right up on those, those are bright. Excellent, yeah. So, I uh, do need to figure out how to route the cables up. And uh, where do those wires come from? So, let's see. Yep, they're going up. So, yeah, through that kind of firewall type. Yeah, up here. So, you know, that might make it pretty dang easy because there's not, there's not like another channel. So, I bet you what it is. They're coming up there. They go down. Um, pretty sure I've noticed that. And they come down for these. They go over for those guys up there. And then they come down again. So, okay. Good. Now for the front. All right, our final walk around. Everything's working like it should. Today's video will be kind of a simpler one, but uh, yeah, went ahead and 
tied these guys up with uh, zip ties as well. Everything's looking a lot tidier. Yeah, easy video, guys. Glad to get that out. It takes a lot longer, you know, trying to make sure that everything's perfect. Nothing's going to, um, you know, come undone or get waterlogged going down the road. So that means that this Friday we'll go ahead and get that hitch installed and we'll be uh, good to go there. Uh, the other thing is we're going to need to figure out where the wires are going because 100% those backlights are coming through uh, these. So got to figure that out and that shouldn't be terribly difficult. We'll just kind of run up, uh, but basically uh, we'll run the wire from down there, wherever it goes, or, you know, basically find the same wire up here somewhere and then just basically tee it off into here and we can use uh the little wago connectors for that that'll be kind of nice but uh yeah yeah anyways glad to have that done slowly very slowly but surely coming along so uh, we also got something in the mail yesterday haven't shown you yet uh, but we have our bed and we have one other thing that we need to be comfortable so yeah see you guys in the next video bye